Twilight director reveals studio's initial doubts about Robert Pattinson. In a surprising revelation, the director of the Twilight franchise has shared that the studio initially had reservations about casting Robert Pattinson in the lead role. The reason? They didn't believe he was hot enough for the franchise. Casting Doubts The Twilight series, based on the novels by Stephanie Meyer, became a global phenomenon, largely due to the on-screen chemistry between its leads, Kristen Stewart and Robert Pattinson. However, it appears that the studio was not initially convinced about Pattinson's suitability for the role of Edward Cullen, the brooding vampire who captures the heart of Bella Swan, Stewart. Not hot enough. According to the director, the studio expressed concerns that Pattinson, now widely recognized as a heartthrob, was not hot enough to play the role of the enigmatic Edward. This revelation is likely to surprise fans, given Pattinson's subsequent rise to stardom and his universally acknowledged good looks. Overcoming Doubts Despite the studio's initial doubts, the director stood by their choice, believing in Pattinson's ability to bring depth and complexity to the character of Edward. Their faith was not misplaced. Pattinson's portrayal of Edward was widely praised, and he quickly became a fan favorite. A global phenomenon the Twilight franchise went on to gross over $3 billion worldwide, catapulting its leads to international fame. Pattinson's performance as Edward Cullen is now iconic, proving that the director's initial faith in him was well-founded. In retrospect, it's hard to imagine anyone else in the role of Edward Cullen. Despite the studio's initial reservations, Robert Pattinson proved to be more than hot enough for the Twilight franchise, leaving an indelible mark on pop culture.